Hey there, YouTube. This is Smitty with bikes, beards, and beer. This is what's between my legs. It's a 2018 Indian Roadmaster Classic. I got the touring windscreen. I got the high flow air filter. I got uh, two inch risers for my short ass arms. I threw a heel shifter on just because I don't like getting stains on my shoes. One of my favorite pieces here is this uh, Captain Itch crotch cooler uh, with the POW MIA um, embroidery. And of, of course, you got to have the, the backrest for when you're crushing 500 mile days. Uh, got my snack pack and uh, water jug holder. And then, of course, you got to have your uh, American flag and POW MIA flag. And of course, not to forget. You have your tab performance zombie baffle exhaust. So tell me what you think. Uh, bike's name is Mia, uh, as in M I A. Just to remind everybody, you know, there's still people that haven't made it home yet. So, you know, thank you for all the troops overseas, and uh, hopefully, you guys come home safely. Hey, everybody, this is Pork Chop. Wave Pork Chop. And I'm Applesauce. And we just wanted to give you a real quick uh, video of our bikes as we're out on our first group ride. Not group ride. Couple ride. Couple ride. Couple ride of the season. So he's going to go order from the Burger Bar. At, no, Burger Board. Burger Board. Burger Board in Jacksonville, Illinois. And I'll show you the bikes. So this is mine. It is a mm, 2006 Yamaha Stratoliner S. Haven't really done anything to it to speak of. It came to us used with some extra little uh, lights that go flashy when we stop. And I really like those because I'm afraid people won't see me even though I have a wide on ass. Everything, as far as I know, is pretty stock about it. The one thing we did add this season is this heat shield. Um, I can't remember Diane something made it for us. It's a single piece of leather and it helps tremendously with my big thighs on the heat in traffic. Um, I ride with an Icon Armada Chantilly helmet that, you know, when I get bored, Stephanie might appreciate this. When I get bored, I take my Sharpies to her. And we have just gotten Cardo Max Talk, Pack Talk Gold so that we can uh, communicate but my old pork chop he's not much of a uh, fan of helmets so I may not ever talk to him again but hell that's why we're on two bikes <laughs> and this is a 2015 victory magnum and we just got it in November or December haven't done too much to it but we have lots of parts that are going on it today so there will be new floorboards new Shift pegs, new passenger pegs. We've got a bunch of stuff to go to it. And the color is plasma green. plasma green. We were told there weren't many of those around. We drove up to Wisconsin to get this sucker. And so that's us. That's the, that's the pork chop and the applesauce of it right there. I don't know if I can get both of us in without running into traffic. There you go. Say bye, Henri asses. Good evening, you ornery asses. So what's between my legs? Well, don't you dirty birds want to know? Well, so far, I have my first street bike, my 2016 Kawasaki Vulcan S. So far, I've done an obnoxiously bright seat, because I like to be obnoxious. Saddlebags, I got an almost useless rack. I rigged up. A muffler. I rigged up a batwing fairing. Added crash guards after I dropped it. With those fog lights. And that's about it for that. But wait, there is more. I also got the 2019 Indian Springfield. So far, I haven't done any mods to that, but eh, not sure I will. Heh, <laughs> famous last words. But at least for now, she's pretty stock. But wait, there's still more. 
For the wife and I, I got a 2002 Honda Goldwing Trike. Because the wifey said she don't like no leaning. 2002. There's still more. For the wife and I, I got a 2002 Honda Goldwing Trike. Because the wifey said she don't like no leaning. She don't like that bike life. So we got trike life. Because if mama ain't happy, ain't nobody happy. Hey, this is Kurt from Farmington, Arkansas, and this is what I ride between my legs. 2006 Softail Standard. 88 inch, 5 speed, carbureted, stage 1, torpedo air cleaner, short shot pipes, added the floorboards for comfort on longer rides, along with floorboards for the passenger. Does have a detachable windshield, quick detach, it's got the detachable sissy bar, it's got the big tire in the rear. Took the stock tail light off, put the LED style in there. It's gray with ghost flames on it. Kind of see them. A little bit of it. Everything's pretty much stock except for the floorboards and the front tire. I put the biggest piece of rubber I could get on that skinny 21 inch pizza slicer just to get rid of some of that road wobble on there. Relocated the turn signals from the handbars down to the forks. Accessory wise, pretty much all I've got is the ram mount from a cell phone, charging station there, cigarette lighter, USB cord plug in. Uh, add the palm, the throttle palm, lifesaver. 28,000 miles on her. And I ride it every chance I get. Thank you. Hey Henri Asses, this is my motorcycle. It's a 2003 Honda VTX 1800R. Bought it a couple of years ago. Most of what you see was on it when I bought it. I added the Velociraptor intake, set of progressive shocks on the rear, and a Barnett carbon fiber clutch kit. New grips and risers on the handlebars. And this here is my wife's 750 Shadow. And we've added the windshield and that's all we've added to it this is moto weasel 66 with this bike green gertie it's a 2017 indian roadmaster in willow green and cream some small upgrades that we did to this bike the first one was removing that stock tall windshield with this short windshield it brings down about three to four inches from the stock so when you are taking this windshield all the way down into the lower position, it will actually provide you with a lot better wind therapy. That kind of gives you an idea how much it lowers that thing down. Next upgrade we did is we took off our standard handlebars, put these mini apes on there. That does put your wrist and your arms in a lot more comfortable position while going down the road. One other thing is Indian likes coming out with just having a toe shifter. I'm not a big fan of just that, so we ended up adding a heel to toe shifter. It does have the stock 111 uh, engine in it. We did add fish tips and a stage one exhaust system. So it gives it a really nice throaty tone. We add a little bit of bling there to the license plate. Also, one thing that we did is we cut down the height of this radio antenna. It has not affected any of the reception that we've gotten. So, Indian, if you can do it on the next go-around, 
shorten that antenna. It's a, it's a good way to get your eyes poked out. But that's a little bit better shot of the exhaust on this side. One other thing we did was we put the captive itch heat guards on here. As anybody who knows who rides a V-twin, usually that rear cylinder, if it's just an air-cooled, will have a tendency of cooking your balls when it's 90 degrees outside. We added those on there, and it made the world of difference on riding. So I'm going to start her up for you, let you guys kind of hear how she does. It's an 05 Road King. It now has 29,000 miles on it. Love to ride this beast. Yes, it's an 88 V-Twin. No real modifications according to the, the books, although I did do an upgrade as far as the uh, chain tensioners goes. I also did an upgrade on handlebars. Put Demon handlebars on it with the chrome casings for all the controls, the burlish hand, or the, the braided wires. And the most impressive thing that I really like, and you gotta see this, the custom dynamic lighting. The custom dynamic saddlebag lighting is absolutely incredible. It lights up the back end of this thing, and I took your advice based on a video that you had had and posted about custom dynamics and that you partnered with them. Well, talk about a partner. On the way home from Paris, Texas, my linkage broke. This right down here it came disconnected. 43 miles away from Denny's in, in uh, your hometown, hometown dealer. Well, we spent the night there and we saw them the following day. They fixed me up with that linkage and we continued home and it was an absolutely wonderful ride, wonderful parade. And I don't know if you remember me, but we met at the end of the night at the uh, Harley Davidson dealer and I offered to buy you a beer, and you looked absolutely scorched from the sun. It was a rough day, but well worth it. Um, I hope you had a good time. It was nice to meet you. My name is Tim. Whoop. We'll flip it around this way. Anyway, Team USA. Whiskey drinker too, my friend. Enjoy your life. Ride the bike. You live once. Enjoy it. What's up, everybody? Redbeard here, Redbeard's Adventures. And Andre One's asking about what's between everybody's legs. So I figured, here's what's between my legs. I've got a 2018 Road King 107. The only thing I've done was change out the uh, slip ons, put some badass little fishtails. I've named this beautiful bike and if you'll notice here I'll get up in the light so you can see that beautiful color. It's Twisted Cherry. I've named this thing the Red Queen. That's right. I've got 13 inch Dominator Industry meat hooks on this thing. HD Get a Grips. Got these when I bought the bike. Best, best grip out there. Avon makes a really good knockoff of them. Um, Put these on only just because they look cool. <laughs> That's it. Changed to a low Mustang crash, or not Mustang, mustache crash bar. So normally I don't roll around with this seat on or this backrest. I took my grandpa, who was 88, the one got me into motorcycling for a ride. Normally I've got this uh, Mustang right here. Beautiful brown, looks better on the bike. Um, no engine mods. Not really big into changing how that runs. Amazon Light Specials, Sun Pie or whatever they were, 100 bucks for all three of those. Those are uh, blinkers are LEDs as well, but they're not like anything special. You know, it's just a bulb replacement. I've done the same on the back for the tail light, but here's what's really cool about the tail light. I love that. People see that a lot better. Super bright. My blinkers do the same. Well, here's how she sounds. Well, 
that's it, y'all. Thanks.